Hello everybody, welcome to another Stay at Home with Summo. I am Alan Tobin, and today we are going to talk about a few things and do some exercises. I am going to talk to you about a few important things right now which is hygiene and washing your hands thoroughly just the right way and everything so I will even do a demonstration for you this morning or this afternoon I mean that way you know the proper ways of doing it. Hands wet. Get some soap. And scrub your hands. Wash most most of the time you can sing a song Say the alphabet. But uh, about 20 seconds, 25 seconds will do. Grabbing your fingers and <laughs> that is pretty much the how long you need to scrub your hands to make sure they stay clean and germ free you need to do that often during the day and Sorry about that notage. Another thing is to take a shower. Take a shower uh, at least once a day, maybe twice. And if you're sweating, then you need to, or doing anything squint, strenuous where you sweat, you need to take a shower then too. And don't forget your deodorant. That's a very uh, important thing because nobody wants to smell your BO. Another thing is. Uh, sorry about that. Your uh, hair. For those that actually have hair, unlike me, is to wash your hair too at least once or twice a week if not more depending on when you're sweating like I was saying and move on to another thing I'd like to thank all of our sponsors I don't remember them all, but a lot of our sponsors, and I would like to say thank you to Target and their Target Circle. Where did I put that? Oh well. Uh, 
couple of other things that I would like to talk to you about would be snacks. It is good to eat some healthy snacks now and then. It's okay to eat potato chips now and then, but a healthy balance would be great. You know, that way you can eat your snack, your unhealthy snacks and your healthy snacks. But keep a balance to that. And hydration. Whenever you're uh, exercising or outside in the heat or any strenuous exercising, make sure you drink plenty of water. And it's good to drink at least six to eight 12 ounce glasses of water a day when you're not doing a lot of strenuous exercises. Speaking of that, I need a drink. Yeah. Oh, let's see what else. I'm going to go ahead and get into some of the exercises and everything. And to start off with, we're going to start with some stretching. off with, I've got a stiff sore neck, so we'll roll the neck to the left. If you're like me, your neck is popping like popcorn. To the right. Okay. Arm over your head, grab a hold of your elbow, and pull on two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other arm, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Okay. Behind, put your arm behind your back, your head, and try to see if, and one behind your back, see if you can touch together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Okay. Other, other way. See if you can. As you can see, I can't do very well on this one. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Going, go down. Well, keep your, put your legs about shoulder length apart. Go down to the center. See if you can touch the ground. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up. Back down. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let me turn this thing off. Okay. Back to what we were doing.
uh, put your legs far apart as you can without falling and see how far you, if you can go down to touch the ground with flat hands one two three and try to keep your legs straight try to keep your legs straight don't one two three four five six seven eight nine ten come in about six inches go back down one two three four five six seven eight nine ten up come in about six inches and go down one two three four five six seven eight nine ten come in feet touching together and go down one two three four five six seven eight nine ten Okay, we're going to do some arm circles. Okay, put your arms out. We're going to go circles about sides of, let's see. About the sides, uh, put your arms out, rotate them forward, about the sides of a Coke can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, keep your arms out. This time we're going to go the size of a medium pizza. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. Keep your arms out. I know they're burning. Mine are. And now we're going to go the size of a large pizza. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Let's see. Okay. Arms straight out, palms up, hold the count of 15. Okay, keep your arm, uh, stick your arms out, palm up, and count to 15. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, turn your arm, your hands over, palms down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, you can. Let your arms down now. 
arms over her head, right? I already did that. Okay. Lay on, get down on the floor. Lay on for bend the ratio. Okay, we're going to do, do a interesting exercise now. Lay flat on the floor. Now, we're going to do We're going to raise our knees and our el uh, elbows about four inches, knees up, and our shoulders about four inches off the ground. I will do one for you just to show how to do it. One, two. Step. You want to get your shoulders off the ground at least this high and your knees up. Put your knees up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now we're going to do this one more time. Okay? A count of ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Okay. Stay on the ground. Uh, this is going to be interesting. Oh, yeah, I remember this one. Okay. Raise your feet up. Count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Spread your legs open. Count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go down. About six, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Close. Down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Close. Down. Don't touch the ground yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Almost ground. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you can rest. For a minute. Okay. Put my marker back up. Roll over and go flat on your belly. Roll 
we're going to do the one thing that Brandon Shotsick doesn't like. And I don't really too much count for it, care for it myself, but hey, whatever. We're going to do the plank. And I am going to, we're going to do both versions, the modified and the regulation. We're going to do the modified first. Okay. We're going to raise your feet. Get up on your elbows. It should be, your elbows should be right underneath your shoulders and about the same width apart. Okay. Ready? Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. We're only going to 30 this time, but try to go to as long as you possibly can, if not 60 seconds to a minute. Now, this, let me take my socks off, because otherwise I won't be able to do this right way. Could also be sliding. Okay, now we're going to do the regulation plank which is on your toes and in your elbows. Have your elbows, like I said, about right under your shoulders and the same about, same about distance. Are you ready? We're gonna count to, go to another 30 on this one. Two. Are you ready? Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, And for those people that like to do other exercises, there are exercise bands. You can get these pretty much at any department store or exercise in the sporting goods department where all the exercise equipment is. I'm going to step on it with both feet and you can one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, we're going to go sideways, out from your body. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we're going to go backwards 
behind your body. I'll turn around sideways so you can see what I mean. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Under your body, grab down a little bit farther on these, and we're going to do a little like jabbing or boxing exercise. One, two, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Okay. over your neck, behind your neck, and we're going to, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, on to something else that's just as important as stretching and exercise. First off, let's get another drink. Uh, what I would else I would like to talk about would be mental exercise. A healthy mind makes a healthy body. Without having a healthy mind, you're not going to be able to do your exercises and play your sports and be the best athlete you can be. When you are exercising or playing sports, sometimes things happen and you get a little frustrated or aggravated. You need to take a breath, breathe, and if you're not in the middle of playing a sport, maybe talk to your coach about going for, uh, to walk around for a little bit, to just uh, get away from things, breathe, and just get your mind off of things. Because when you're frustrated and upset, you're not going to be able to do your best. You're going to be thinking about what upset you and frustrated you. And that's not going to do any good for either you or anybody else. Because you're not going to be able to concentrate and be your best during your events. And plus... Hey, it's not healthy either. When uh, you get upset uh, is, and everything is not good. Well, a health, uh, like I said, a healthy mind, a healthy body. Maybe go look at uh, one of our past shows that Alyssa Crest did on sports psychology. I would like to say thank you for being here and watching with us. And I would like to say have a great weekend and stay safe 
and have fun. I'm Alan Tobin for Summo Stay at Home. Have a great weekend. Bye.